Before we continue with the rest of the video, we could use your help. Click that like button to help spread the word about Watch JoJo, and also be sure to subscribe and click the notification bell so you don't miss our future videos. Experts have found the remains of a cave girl whose parents belonged to an altogether different species. We're all curious about our roots. We want to know how and where we came from. Who are our ancestors? Researchers are trying to dig out the answers to these questions, literally. A few years back in 2010, a young female finger bone was discovered in Denisova Cave, Siberia. It was dated to 40,000 years ago. This finding led us to our distant ancestors, hominins. Hominins are human like us only, but they're not from our specific species. They call the man Denisovan and the woman Neanderthal. The Denisovans, Neanderthal, and the Homo sapiens at a point of time occupied the same cave. This cave is the place where four fossil remnants of a foot bone, a couple teeth, and the finger bone were found. The researchers were sure about the existence of the hominins, but they were not able to figure out how these early humans looked like or how they lived. It all started in 1829 when an incomplete skull was discovered in a Belgian cave. Following this, two more skulls were discovered in the years 1848 and 1864, confirming the Neanderthal remains. Geologist William King coined the name Homo Neanderthalensis eight years after the partial Neanderthal skull was discovered in Germany's Neander Valley in 1856. Not much is known about Denisovans, but researchers have been able to crack down the mystery of Neanderthals. Neanderthals were basically hunters and they used to make tools out of stone. They even knew how to make fire. A lot has been discussed and debated about the art and culture of the Neanderthals by the scientists. Scientists believe that the Denisovans and Neanderthals met each other in Eurasia. The Denisovans lived in the east of Eurasia and later the Neanderthals migrated towards the east from the western part of Eurasia. The interesting discovery was the bone of a girl who died in her teens. A detailed DNA study proved that the girl had a Denisovan father and a Neanderthal mother. It clearly shows that not only these two hominins crossed paths with each other, but they also mated. This interesting piece of information would have been lost in oblivion if not for Samantha Brown. She's a researcher at Oxford University. She was the first one to bring into notice that the proportion of Neanderthal DNA and Denisovan DNA in that bone is evenly split. Harvard geneticist David Reich said that it was the first generation hybrid product. There's almost 2% Neanderthal in most Asians and Europeans. The whole evidence of interbreeding between the ancient hominins, Neanderthals and Denisovans, both extinct for some 40,000 years, make for an interesting fact. This is how the current breed of Homo sapiens came into existence. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe and hit that bell icon to stay up to date with all our daily videos.